Hey guys, this is Sonny from Rippin' Lips. Um, I just wanted to show you a tip that I, uh, something that I do to save money on the fishing line. And um, just kind of a good way to, that you should kind of do this every time. Um, what I do is I go, like after I'm done fishing, if I'm going to be changing my line when I get home, or I feel like the line's worn or whatever, uh, what I'll do is I'll take one of my lures that I get the farthest distance of, of my casts. And then I'll maybe, right when it lands, I'll strip out maybe like five extra feet. And then I'll take a piece of paper or a leaf on the ground or whatever and put it right here under the line like that and then I'll and then I'll start reeling it in so that way when I get home I can pull out the line and it will be right where the paper is so I can pull out maybe a couple extra feet and then cut it and then put new line on spool it back up that way I don't have to fill the spool every single time because um, one of your spools say if you have a 330 foot spool or yards or whatever I can get five respools on that, but if I refill it every time, I can only get maybe two to three. So, another thing too is on mono or fluorocarbon, you can take a sharpie and just mark the line right where it is. <clears throat> That's just one of the tips that I, uh, or one of the things I do to save money on fishing line. But uh, try that out. See how much money you save and fish on. See you later.